developer beta 2 is out should you update it well i downloaded it on my iphone 10 and i'm going to share with you some of the new features and if it's worth the download coming up right now let's go 12 beta 1 16a 5288q i had 234.78 gigabytes i want to show you how much storage i gained here with the update so i gained about almost a gig there so definitely gained some space with this update so right off the bat if you want some more storage back you're going to get it here there's a new build number 16a 5308e for ios 12 beta 2. okay so first thing i noticed on beta 2 was the new voice memo splash screen is now available for the device you only see that one time anyway going into settings in battery this is definitely a little bit touched up here you can see that it looks different than before in beta 1 and overall i really like the way this is looking i think it's going to get even better by the final release so Definitely gonna be a little bit more detailed when it comes to checking out how you're using up your battery. Next up in the Apple Photos apps, I noticed that it's a little bit more precise now. So I can actually search the date. So I'm gonna go June 18th, for example, 19th. And that was actually today. I'm actually working on a photo comparison. And if you take a look at the picture I took this morning of nature, it was actually today. So this is pretty cool that you can search like by the date and it's getting a little bit more precise when it comes to searching in photos. I always like to check to see if there is any new wallpaper. So let's go to settings, wallpapers, and we don't see an update to wallpapers here to iOS 12 beta 2. So none of those are new if you do care about that. We now have a new location icon right there. It's a little bit softer than it was before and it just looks a little different than before. So if you care at all about new icon changes like that next to the percentage, you can see that new location icon that's there in iOS beta 2 as well. One small little detail I noticed is that if I go ahead and scroll up on this iPhone 8 plus iOS 11 and I go to click my timer, um, the shape looks a little bit different. So look at those shapes at the bottom, comparatively speaking, they're a little bit different. And uh, I noticed that little thing as well in iOS 12 beta 2. You now have support for iPhone 6 style apps on the iPad. We don't have an iPad to show that, but that is available here on iOS 12 beta 2 as well. Heading back into the settings, we're going to go into the screen time and check out the new screen time setting here. So if we go into screen time, you can see that there is a new splash screen as well, right? Permits, I'm not seeing too much of a difference. Battery life dropping at about the same rate so far, but again, it just dropped. So I would have to use it for a few more days to give you a more definitive answer on how the battery is going. I noticed in beta one, my phone was getting a little hotter than normal. That's expected. This is a beta. It's not, you know, uh, stock software so i would expect that uh twitter is still unfunctional so if you want to use twitter and you're not already logged in if you logged out you're pretty much out and you're not going to get into twitter on your iphone also netflix can present some issues specifically when you are downloading certain movies in addition to that if you use time application here for ios 12 beta 2 you're going to probably run into some issues so the question is should you update your iphone to ios 12 developer beta 2 if you're testing it of course if if you're using it as a daily driver i definitely would say hold off this is clockwork right now for apple they got a few months left before the new iphones they're just getting things started right now and there's going to be many more betas to come so this is still developer so you need to be a developer to use this driver definitely not i've been trying to use this as a daily and ios 12 is just not ready for daily prime time for me anyway if you found this video helpful enjoyable entertaining informing do me a favor click that like button for me and if you have any video suggestions comments concerns questions drop them down below in the comment section of this video subscribe if you have